Item Number SCP-1663 Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures Data pertaining to research performed at Containment Site 1663-0 may only be disseminated to personnel assigned to Containment Site 1663-0 or with prior permission from at least two senior researchers. Duty assignments at Containment Site 1663-0 are not to exceed two weeks in length, and all personnel must be administered Class B amnestics prior to being transferred off-site. Description SCP-1663 is the special duty assignment for personnel assigned to Containment Site 1663-0, located near The research performed at Containment Site 1663-0 is considered a Euclid-class infohazard, thus necessitating the extraordinary containment requirements outlined in this document. The data isolation of SCP-1663 was approved on by the then-retiring O5 whose immediate retirement and subsequent mandatory amnestic administration was considered not in violation of standing regulations prohibiting the exposure of O5 council members to SCP objects. Since then, separate retiring O5 council members have upheld the established containment procedures for SCP-1663. Personnel assigned to SCP-1663 may continue on to the additional documentation for SCP-1663 personnel. Access granted. Item number SCP Psi Lambda Zero. Object class Euclid. Special containment procedures. SCP Psi Lambda Zero is contained in a secure locker at containment site 1663 0. Dissemination of the existence of SCP Psi Lambda Zero or any information related to it is forbidden as per SCP 1663 protocols, and personnel assigned to SCP 1663 or SCP Psi Lambda Zero must be administered Class B amnestics prior to being transferred off site following the maximum allowed assignment length of two weeks. Description SCP Psi Lambda Zero is a Lady Liberty $5 coin minted in 1880, consisting primarily of gold with trace impurities of data expunged. Its anomalous effect is triggered whenever any human subject observes, touches, or is otherwise informed of SCP Psi Lambda Zero's existence. The nature of this object does not need to be explained, simply identifying it by name is sufficient. Within approximately three weeks of exposure to SCP Psi Lambda Zero, affected subjects begin to develop a pathological revulsion to the ownership, restraint, or containment of any material wealth. Affected subjects will begin by donating or gifting all of their possessions, while attempting to convince others to relinquish their possessions. After approximately six weeks, subjects will show increasing hostility towards others with material possessions, eventually culminating with a refusal to take possession of any material whatsoever, even food or water, after which subjects typically dehydrate and starve unless sedated and given sustenance intravenously. The only known preventative measure is to administer an amnestic of at least Class B strength prior to manifestation of initial symptoms. SCP Psi Lambda Zero was redesignated following O5 P's attempt to order the release of all SCP objects contained worldwide. Fortunately, O5 P was the only O5 Council member with knowledge of SCP Psi Lambda Zero at the time, and was successfully terminated after his order was rescinded by other O5 Council members. At the time, SCP Psi Lambda Zero was designated SCP. Its current designation was specifically created to remove it from standard Foundation object databases and to prevent its positive identification by any personnel other than those at Containment Site 1663-0. SCP Psi Lambda Zero's current containment procedures are to be reviewed by retiring O5 Council members within two weeks of their retirement and mandatory amnestic administration. To date, Retiring O5 Council members briefed on SCP Psi Lambda Zero have unanimously chosen to uphold the existing containment procedures. Site 42 is able to continue broadcasting and move up to making live action SCP adaptations thanks to support from our viewers, subscribers, and especially our patrons. Special shout out to our level 5 researcher level patron, Andre Bechert.